Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking to you and showing you everything that I have purchased to go inside of my daughter's stocking. Um, I will also do a separate video for what's in my son's stocking. I thought I would just split the videos in two so they're not too long and obviously you can click on which one or both that you want to watch basically or what you need to take inspiration from. My daughter is nine years old, she will be 10 in May. She hasn't given me a very long list of things um, so I found her stocking quite tricky to be honest but I feel like I've got a really good selection um, and some good ideas so I thought I would get this video up now so you've got a good week or so before Christmas if you need to pop out and um, top up anything, any stockings. So I'm sorry it's a bit late this year, but with having a newborn, um, <laughs> Christmas has been crazy and I feel like I've left it all last minute. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below where you organize this year. Um, I feel like it's just me and I'm not organized um, and it's the first year ever that I've been like this. Um, and if you're new here, if you've not seen any of my other videos before, then I'd really appreciate if you'd consider hitting the subscribe button and following me here on YouTube. Okay, so to start with, we need to talk about her stocking. So this isn't new, I purchased this last year. Um, I've got my son, he has exactly the same. It has their name there in glitter red, it says Darcy. Um, and it just says, express delivery from the North Pole, do not open before December the 25th. Of course, I love these sacks. Um, they're a really good size. And in the past, I've had really, really, really big stockings. And then I felt the pressure to fill them. Um, I'm kind of over that now. I've just got them bits that I know they will love and that they need. So you'll see some bits in here. You might think, why are you putting that in a stocking? But it's things that I know they will need and that they'll love. So let me know in the comments if you, you know, what you put in your stockings. I always love to have ideas. Um, but yeah, let's jump straight in. So nothing is wrapped yet. Um, we'll do the wrapping after and then we'll get this done and that'll be another thing ticked off of this mummy's to-do list. Okay, so to start with, I always put a selection box in their stockings. They will have a chocolate Santa um on the presents in the front room but what we do with the stocking that is put on their bed every single year so that when they first wake up in the morning they see the stocking it's what i had um when i was growing up and then they bring their stockings into our room and we all sit on our bed and we open them and see what um they have in their stockings so it's just a really lovely way to kind of like kick start the morning basically um so yeah i always put a selection box in their um, stockings, I think this was a pound, I might have even got two for a pound on offer, but yeah, they're really reasonable this year, the selection boxes, so that's the first thing. Okay, next up, um, I have got, I picked up a few little bits and pieces from a shop called Smiggle. If you've seen any of my other videos, you will have heard me talk about this before. The kids both love this shop for stationery, school supplies, backpacks, lunch boxes, that sort of thing. Um, so yeah, they absolutely love it. And I went on there, I tend to always only shop when they have like a big sale on, because you do find some really amazing pieces. First up, I picked up this travel pillow. Um, if we manage to get away next year, or just journeys in the car, it's just a really lovely kind of like unicorn print. And I'm not joking, it is the softest thing. It doesn't have like beams in it, it's just straight memory foam. So it kind of like moulds, it's really, really good. And I I think I paid about six pound for this. I also got one for my son, so you'll see that in my haul. But that's the first thing. Next up, I picked up a sewing pin cushion. She's really into her sewing at the moment. She's got a sewing machine, lots of fabrics, um, cottons, that sort of thing. And I know she doesn't have one of these. So I thought when she's pinning, she likes to make bandanas for the dogs in the family. So I thought she could obviously wear this like this and she could have her little pins and then as she's like pinning the fabric it'd just be really handy so I don't find pins on my floor but yeah this was from Home Bargains I think and I think it's about 69p so cheap okay next up I picked up this makeup bag or wash bag from Primark it was three pound and it's just in this Teddy Borg material and it's cream so yeah really good size and she loves everything in this material at the moment so I know she'll love that Sticking with that theme, I also picked her up a headband. This was £2 from Primark, and again, it's in that Teddy Borg material. 
I also picked her up a um, chapstick. This was from Primark. It was £2.50. It's kind of like a Jolly Rancher, kind of like two flavoured one. So I got that for her. I also picked her up a hot water bottle. I wasn't going to get one this year because they do have a couple of hot water bottles. But this one's kind of like a really good size. She's got bigger ones in her room. So I thought... If she just wants one, like when she's down on the sofa, this is quite a good size. Um, it's not like too big. So it's got her initial D on it. This was from B&M and this was five pounds. The initial range in B&M is so good. I spoke about it last Christmas and it's even better this Christmas. So if you are stuck for ideas, highly recommend checking out B&M. Okay, next up, these are the things that I know they need. So you might think, why are you putting that in the stocking? But I just do it every year. I used to have it in my stocking when I was growing up, so I kind of just like incorporate it into my children's stocking. So we've got a new set of underwear, some pants. So it's not Christmas unless you get some new pants. So I got her those. They were from Primark. Um, six briefs, they were six pounds. So just kind of like some plain ones. And then I got her 10 pairs of trainer socks. Again from Primark, they were £2.80 for 10 pairs. I don't know what happens, but we have a sock monster in this house, so yeah, they always need socks. So I got her those. And then I also got her, I have these myself, and she always goes into my drawer and takes them because we're a similar size. So I did pick her up her own fluffy socks. Again, these are Primark £2.50, and they're just, can you see how fluffy they are? And they're just kind of like the neutral brown and beige colours. Okay, we're not done with the socks yet. I did get her another pair of fluffy socks, so these are more so for at home. Christmas themed from Primark. Primark have got some amazing um, stocking fillers and things like that. So again, another place I would highly recommend checking out. These were £2.50 for two pairs. Kind of like reindeer with the little Santa hat and then just some festive coloured polka dot ones there. Super fluffy. Both my children love to like when they get home from school put their fluffy socks on and their pyjamas and be cosy. So I knew she would love those. Okay, next up, this is something that I picked up in HomeSense. It's one of those like random purchases that I found on one of the shelves. So it's a hair wrap. So um, if she's in the bath or she's doing, I don't know, like her face cream or just playing with her makeup. I just thought it's really cute. Um, she does tend to wear them when she's having a bath and she doesn't want to get her hair wet. But she won't necessarily want to wear a like shower cap. So I thought this was really cute. It was 2 dollars Okay, next up, again, this is from HomeSense. This was 4 99 It's a hair turban for after you've washed your hair. I got one from my mum last Christmas. It's like an ultra absorbent. So it's supposed to take like 80% of the moisture out of your hair without it being wrapped too tight so it's not going to cause any damage to your hair. So um, Darcy does use that. So I thought I would get her her own. And it's in like a beautiful lilac colour. The reflection of the lights on my trees, which is behind, is um yeah there you go so it's like a lovely lilac color so i got her that and then i also got her a couple of sets of scrunchies um these were from primark they were pound fifty a set i did get two um because she does tend to wear her hair in either low kind of like bunchies or half up half down bunchies and she hasn't got two of the same so she'll wear like odd colors but she looks lovely but i thought they're only 150 i'll get her two sets and then if she does want to wear matching she has the option to do that so they're just kind of like black beige and then like a um briny color so really lovely neutral colors and i'm sure we'll be able to share those as well um i also picked her up this set of scrunchies from primark they were two pound these are just a bit thicker so more safe for when she has it like all up in a ponytail it's the borg material black a nice beige and then a faux leather effect one there anything like this scrunchies hair ties um like beauty things she absolutely loves so that's the sort of route i go down with stockings um i don't like to spend a lot um but again i don't want to just fill it with things that aren't going to get used um i have that has happened in the past um so i just like to take my time and make sure everything i've got i know they'll use um next up i picked up when i did that smiggle order there was a metal water bottle. This is so beautiful. I think this is about four pound, which is an absolute bargain for Smiggle. It was in the cell um, and it's all glittery. Can you see the sparkle there? So th this is perfect for keeping her water cold. She does ballet, a few dance lessons a week and for school. Um, and I always tend to get them a new bottle for Christmas and it just says Smiggle 
on the bottom just there so i know she will absolutely love that okay also i picked up in bnn a hottie hand warmer Re it's reusable it's one pound fifty um and it's just got a really lovely rainbow on it so i thought while it's winter she can take it to school and keep it in her pocket um i'm not sure how you actually you will have you will have instant heat for up to 30 minutes to reuse simply wrap in a cloth and heat in boiling water for 10 to 15 minutes so you just heat it up with water um so i was looking for one for ollie actually um, when i go back in i might see if they've got one for ollie because i know he will love this as well but yeah for £1.50 that's like the perfect little stocking filler and then next up i've got just some little crafty bits so again this is from smiggle so i got all of this in the cell um each thing was no more than a couple of pounds each. I don't remember exactly off the top of my head. I will try and link in the description what I can. So, first up, I just have this fidget pen. She loves everything fidget at the moment. So you can kind of like just like twist all these in different directions. Um, and she loves writing. So I thought that was lovely and it's nice to look at. She can keep it in her pen pot. I got her a pair of scissors, so they're her own um just for if she's cutting up paper she doesn't have to use our big kitchen scissors um they're really lovely they kind of like have smiggle written on them with some unicorns um yeah and i've also got some for ollie as well i got her another pen so this is just like a decorative pen it you can obviously write with it but it doesn't have any fidget things it's just obviously like a pretty little pen and then i also picked up this um sharpener eraser and tipex it's like a roll on tipex if they make a mistake so again it's just part of the little bits and pieces you can get i think it's five things for five pound on smiggle um i'll see what i can find online and i'll link it below but yeah i just thought that will come in really handy for when she's doing any homework or any writing and then last up i picked up a bath bomb from lush for her so this is in the scent snow fairy it smells amazing i have dropped major hints to tom that I want this for, in, like for Christmas. I just need a bath in this bath bomb. It's so beautiful. Um, I need to be careful because there's going to be glitter everywhere. But yeah, if you... Oh my goodness. I can't describe to you the smell. It is, it is just so lovely. I just feel like I need the shower gel and everything. I'm going to go back in and get some little bits for myself. Um, but yeah, I just thought I've given them both a nice bath bomb for their stocking they do like to have bath bombs and i thought it's like a festive one and it smells lovely and what we can actually do if we cut it carefully that we she can get two baths out of that and um, tom can cut it in half for her hold up i am on my way i'm in motion let's go to the ocean yeah let's go outside we can hang out without freezing yeah isn't that amazing in christmas times we'll be just okay so that's everything that i've got my daughter for her stocking for christmas this year i really hope you enjoyed this video i hope it gave you some ideas as i said at the start please let me know what you put into your stockings because i love to take all these ideas um and maybe i can incorporate it for next year um and other people watching the video you know if we all help each other out everyone can read the comments and take ideas that way but i really hope you enjoyed don't forget to give the video a thumbs up as i said if you're not already please please consider hitting that subscribe button and joining me here on youtube i post vlogs hauls cleaning motivational videos lots and lots of different videos so yeah i really hope you'll consider joining me here on youtube and without further ado, I will say goodbye and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone. and having a good, good time. Doesn't matter if the snow is falling.